Good morning. It is 20 to 9. And look me, full face of slap already. Christ, someone woke up early. Um, so I am going to do another day in the life. I've done a few of these today. Uh, today, not, not today, because that would be weird. This past week or two. Um, I'm going into town. I'm not going to record the whole thing going there and stuff because I've done that already. But any highlights within what's happening and whatever, I'll put that in. And just, you know, go about me day, as it were. I usually end up with... No, not on my teeth. <laughs> Lipstick on my teeth. Um, But yeah. I've had to slap my hair up because, to be fair, it actually needed washing. So it was a bit of dry shampoo and then chucked it up. Um, so, yes, I am going to, well, wait for the carer, basically. Um, so, yeah, I'll just uh, film anything along the way that may be of interest. Don't know why, though, but still. Anyway, catch you in a bit. Hello, it's um, what time is it now? It's quarter eleven, I think. Um, I'm only just actually having my breakfast, so there was a bit of a delay with my carer, etc. So, just finishing my toast, um, and my cup of tea, um, and and then I'm going out. What time is it? Did I say I'm going out at? Half twelve. Um, going into town. I don't know if I said this already. And um, yeah, have a couple of have a have a have a spy around the park and mooch in a couple of shops and yeah. Um, and I'll be back when there's something interesting to tell you. Um, I'm just in the park, Mulberry Park that is, the one in the tune in the town. <laughs> um, it, uh, I think it's 20 to 1, about that anyway. There's the cenotaph, um, oh someone's not happy. That used to be the uh, old civic centre up there. Well, we had a civic centre and now we've got City Hall because it's been rebuilt elsewhere. I don't know what's going to happen to that building. It's very uh, ancient. Um, yeah, I'm just going to go have a wander and take a few pictures probably and then uh, see where I'm sat and get up to, I guess. Um, yeah. I've showed this before, it's Veterans Walk, you can have like a plaque put in um, and then either be ser still serving or previously served, whichever, but it goes right round. Anyway, I'll catch you in a bit. It's starting to look really pretty with all the flowers coming out and that, well, I keep it well planted in here, it always looks really nice and looked after and stuff um, it doesn't look like when you're coming along here it doesn't look like this would be Sunderland with, it, with these sort of tropical looking plants and stuff um, yeah that sun keeps going in though there's some a lot of cloud and I need the sun for my for my photographs Oh, yes. There's a, um, a white walk which is down the bottom and along. But you, you go down there. There is a ramp all the way down, but it freaks me out a bit, so I didn't bother. And when you go down there, there's loads of rabbits along that way. I mean, I sometimes see them in the park, but there's loads down there. Probably a lot of other things and all, but again, I just get freaked out. 
Oh, look. I think I just saw a bee. Do I see a bee? What's our matching and things? No, it must be one of the dwellers. Maybe it's just maybe I just imagined it, but I'm sure I saw a bee. Pretty them, whatever they are. Yeah, so this is White Walk. I've just come up onto the bridge to show you. All I can see is uh, a couple of big looking wood pigeons from here. But yeah, you can go along there. But uh and this is the bridge, but I don't go over that side because that bank is just way too steep for me. There's a play area and other statues and God knows what along here. And the play area is over there. But yeah, it's just a bit steep for me. Anyway, I'm go back. I shall go back. Right. That bike just freaked me out. <laughs> oh, jeez. Yeah. Go down this way. I mean, look at the flowers. Yeah, that wind though. I don't know if you can hear us, hope you can. But yeah, oh, it looks lovely. Anyway, I'm gonna put you, I'm gonna stop recording and go and take some more pictures. Bye. I'm so tempted by no pads <laughs> moving away. Some lovely stuff in TK Maxx. Around here always absolutely smells like um it's got every smell going really. Um ooh, some things is reduced. Zara. I've only actually come in to look for a little cuddly toy for my um, one of my carers. Her daughter's had a baby, little girl. So I was trying to think where I could go to get something for something for her, for you know, to say congrats and all that. Um, and I thought I'll have a look at the baby section in here, but I like it in here because it's. I can get round everywhere and it's it's roomy and stuff and the the weird thing is with TK Maxx is or you can look at one thing and it'll be like oh that's not a bad price and you look at something else and it's like what three hundred quid for that or at least that's the way I kind of look at it um but they have got some rather lovely things. I could quite easily spend quite a lot of money in here if I had it like. <laughs> oh, that trolley thing's canny. I need one of these. Well, the only thing is, is I'd just load it over twenty four ninety nine. Mm. I'd probably just end up overloading it. Lots of spices and stuff. Chocolates and that. Hmm. I don't know why I'm in this section for because I need the baby stuff, don't I? I quite often get Jasper to meet when I'm in here. Hmm. I think it's over there. Around here and over there. I mean, I could look everything else, but there's a temptation then. <laughs> so. I shall go over here.
Um, well, I'm at toys. Hey. I've got some cuddly stuff up there. Not quite right for a baby though, is it? Oops. I'm not and everything with my bags. Oh, look at that. I want I want a swan rocker. I know I might struggle to get me one cheek in that thing. I definitely would struggle. Oh, they're pretty. Um, no, I don't need hairbands. Okay. It's a little... Oh, I can't get I love you on. Well, you know, it's just a bit weird, isn't it? Um, <laughs> Looney Tunes. Uh, uh, uh. Baby Nat. Where the baby Nat? Am I pointing at the right thing? No. Um, the monkey and the seal. It's not really baby girl thing, is it? Um, lots of Peter Rabbit, Billy and Audrey, whoever they are. Oh, and this is more bottles and feeders and things. Lots of baby claws. But I bought a little pink cream outfit thing. Oh my god. Look at that. Oops, crushing. I mean, <laughs> I'm sure a baby wouldn't want one of them, would they? No. I think there's only them ones I've looked at for choice. I'll have to go back, have a look. Um, See, because it's got it's grey, so I want it to be pink. Oh, wait a minute, what's that? Can't reach. Got it. Got that one. Hmm. That one. Oh, or a baby nut, maybe. Um, the bunny's cute in it. It's one of them. Uh, um, it's a teddy bear one. Oh, cute. Okay. <laughs> How cute. Don't know if I'm in the right direction. That's cute. But I'm not sure. Oh, I'm going to crash in a minute. I keep leaning on the control and it's moving as far away. <laughs> right, I'm going to switch me thing off before I put myself somewhere else. <laughs> I'm guessing that's meant to be a stalk. Even though the brand's called Happy Horse. It's definitely not a happy horse that like. <laughs> um Baby Nut, I think it's gonna be what it is. That one I think. Yeah. I'm gonna get this and go pay for this and I shall see you in a bit. Well, I'm back home, but I can't shut my doors because that one's blue in and that one's 
blue route back and I kind of get it because there's a step down. So it'll have to stay open. I just have to wait until the gear comes. To be fair, she's only going to be half an hour, but yeah. Life. Just um, watching the lovely Lex and um, <laughs> I went to the shops a bit, can you tell? <laughs> um, yeah, I'm going to do a separate um, home bargains haul and then um, and then I'll show you what else I got, probably. Um, but first, before all of that, and whilst I'm watching Lex, I'm going to eat this. So this is my dinner slash tea because I wasn't in for dinner. Um, so the two mini wraps from Tesco uh, with seafood um, sandwich filler and lettuce inside the wraps, which has been chopped up, and then cucumber on the side. The reason the cucumber is on the side and not inside is that because I've got a false um, denture on the top, when you bite in a... Normally, it's like full slices, isn't it? And it, when I bite into it, it kind of pulls all of everything out because my my teeth don't cut through it, like when it's inside the sandwich properly. Maybe it's just me, but... So it's easier if it's on the side. Um, and I've also got... Um, a meringue case and an aero mint yoghurt for after and a lovely cup of tea with a fox <laughs> anyway i'm going to enjoy this and i shall be back hello so it's um quarter to six yeah it's quarter to six and i just thought i'd show you what i got in the charity shop um there is still quite a bit in there there's um three tops for my son um yeah, three tops for my son and a pair of jogging bottoms and two pair of, I think the jeggings for my daughter. But I, I'll not show you them. I'll just show you what I got for me. So I got this, which is just like a sparkly purse. It's, it's new with the tags from Tyrac. Cost just two quid. And I just thought if ever I do go anywhere fancy, like actually for for whatever then I can use this because then I can strap it to my hand and also this would fit down the side of my sling if needs be and plus I just thought it was pretty it's just all all sequency glittery and then I got some tops for me they may all not fit me right now so I got this one um this is uh, ASOS's plus range um, it was £2.50 um, I don't think that will fit me yet actually but yeah then I got this which is really pretty but it's um, it's actually see through <laughs> it's pretty see through um, but this uh, is from yours um, it was four pound. Um, so that first top was in Salvation Army. This is a size thirty-two, and this was from the British, yeah, British Red Cross. Um, so yeah, so there's that one, and then there's this, which I love this print. Really like this print. It's like um, linen-y, but I think it's cotton. Uh, so this is from J.D. Williams. Uh, this is a 30, so probably won't fit me yet. Also four quid. I think that's four quid. Yeah. Um, and then I got this one, which is just like a silky black. But I thought with it, with these button down front ones, because all these are button down front, this, the two I've shown and this, I could have them open with like a vest top underneath if... You know, like in the summer and that, because I don't like having my arms on display. That's if they fit me. Um, so this is from Capsule. Um, and is 
uh, it say? 32 and this was four quid. And I mean, they don't look worn any of these. These are all from the Red Cross. And then these is from JD Williams. This is a like a t-shirt material top. And that was four quid, uh, size 32. And again, it, they don't look like they've been worn. So I'm well tough with that. And then um, I went into home bargains, but I'm going to do that separate. And the other thing I got was in here, which I may need to hold hold on a second. <laughs> and the other thing I got was this, and um, yeah, um, <laughs> it cost me. I haven't looked at it properly. It cost me. Uh, 30 quid actually but there's a lot of carded stuff and I figured I could give them as gifts um you know what I mean so there's a lot of carded stuff now and I have no clue what else but um yeah I um I bought when was it the last time I went I think I bought a but uh, like a little or maybe the time before no I don't think I was filming I think I filmed the last time I went um so yeah so it must have been a couple of weeks ago that i bought like a little bag full for like four quid um and i really enjoyed detangling it and everything it was like like really therapeutic <laughs> so i totally get like uh it, well why why lex and then anyone else who does jewelry just for that bit was like really chilling i just like Put the music on plus i do love jewelry anyway and um yeah and I've, i think i've got lots of uh lots of presents i can give to friends and family and stuff as well so yes um and that is basically everything uh as i said i'll do the home bargains thing separate and i'm gonna flip you around because i'm probably gonna wrap this up um Oh, I will show you these. These I bought these out of Tesco for four quid. Look at them. How cute are they? Um but I need to put them with the little the little um rabbit that I bought today. Um and the little outfit that I got to put in the in the parcel. Right. Anyway, um I'm gonna flip you around. So, yes, it's been a good day. I've had, a, I've had a really good day. I went through the park, if you see, as you've seen. And then I bought some bits and I've been there uh, home bargains. And um, I've just realised it's it's actually five to six now. And um, I've got a, a, a premiere, a premiere prem, I can't see it. But one of them going live at uh, six o'clock, so I better get a shift on. But I just wanted to wrap up the video and say thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you're not already subscribed, please do. Um, I really appreciate it. And um, I will put another video here if anyone wants to watch that after. That would be great. And I shall catch you next time. Bye-bye now. Bye-bye.